And today, it seems that home rule took yet another blow from these uh, House Republicans. I'm being kind. Could you explain to your constituents who will be listening tonight what happened with, as it applies to a woman's right to choose, and D.C. women, if you will? It looks like D.C. is displacing jobs is one of the priorities of the new Republican Congress, because uh, yet another invasion of home rule. And this one is quite extraordinary. Uh, finally got off the rider that kept us from spending our own local funds on abortions for low-income women. Now, there are dozens of jurisdictions that do this all over the country. Got it off when Democrats were in the majority. Now they're trying to put it back on, along with, with, with other riders. But how do they do it this time? They put us inside of a horrific uh, abortion bill, which uh, penalizes women uh, and their insurance companies. Uh, if they choose to use abortion. And somehow or the other, this nationwide bill has the District of Columbia in it. And in effect it says, for purposes of this bill, we're federalizing the District of Columbia for abortion purposes. And this would be a bill that would not be a rider for one year, where it has to be renewed every year. This would be a permanent bill that would say the district couldn't use its own local funds for this purpose. Now there is no purpose for which the district should be able to use its own local funds, that is legal. And this is legal, it is constitutional, it is an outrage. My good friends on the Judiciary Committee, I'm not a member of that committee, in my behalf, uh, made their First Amendment. Indeed, John Conyers himself uh, came forward with this as their First Amendment, went down on a party line vote. That's what we've got over here. Um, the fact that you don't have people moderate enough on even home rule grounds to say, okay, I'll give them this vote, is really the story of the Tea Party Republicans. And nobody should think about the Republican majority here as anything but the Tea Party majority. They, they control the majority. And the interesting thing is uh, there has been some notice that we're trying to focus, they, they say, on cuts and therefore we're not going to give quite the same, and they've told this apparently to the social conservatives, the same um, uh, 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 priority uh, to these social conservative issues, except for the District of Columbia. So they're coming at us for a classic social conservative uh, issue. Uh, let the district be the district, we're going to fight it. There are three branches of government. Uh, I have already been in touch with the Senate and the administration saying it's up to you. Please do the right thing. And what would be your